What's up guys, here to show you how to do Heroic Inquisitor White Main. I think this was a red level quest at this time, so the, the starts are a little bit uh, different depending on who you got, and, uh, and um, you just have to play around with the starts until you kind of figure out the best way. I, I really like the chickens and the harpies in this for a good DPS, you absolutely don't need that, but the speed on them is really big, so... Uh, Huntress is, is one of the worst cards, and uh, I did not deal with this very well at all, so um, yeah, that's just a really, really bad start. I probably should have just restarted, but here we are. Um, so the whole point is they both have to die basically at the same time, or within about five to seven seconds of each other. So uh, you want to do as much chip damage as you can um, to one of them, and I think the, the best thing is the guy on the right. So... Uh, obviously, they're throw footmen down. You got to take advantage of that and you do something like wall pegs. And we have like a good split push here. So, if I can get uh, tank behind and then maybe push on the right and do something kind of kind of tricky on the on the right, maybe I can kill them both at the same time. Sometimes that does work. Uh, so yeah, that, that right that tank right in the back. He's divine shielding, but then they put that Drake down and that just ruined my whole whole plan. So. Uh, it's if you don't kill them at the same time, it's basically a reset. So um, it is kind of what it is. But I'm hoping right now that I can at least take this guy down a little bit. If I can take him down to like almost full life or almost no life, that's a really really good place to be because that means all we have to do is focus on the other lane. And as soon as she's about to die, then we just finish him off on the right with some well bags or, or whatever, some safe pilot on top, some kind of unbound stuff or just running your fast uh, DPS in on it. So we're not too concerned put those footmen down kind of kind of screwed our chickens but um, we're just trying to do as much as we can to uh, the left side right now until we have a really good push going in on her and then we can take them both out at the same time. So that's the best thing get as much damage as you can without killing him on the right and then uh, focusing out on the left and then just kind of defense as you need. We got our poison harpies, we have well bags, we got everything coming in right now, so we're looking pretty good right now. We're, we're thinking we can probably uh, safe pilot the guy on the right and, and kill him, right? Oh, no, Huntress just stopped all that again. But it's okay, they're both low, not dead, so that's helpful. And uh, just waiting to, to get our next little push in, and this one should do it. You know, I said that before, but uh, we have our fast DPS coming in, put something behind an unbound tank to tank and now I'm thinking I need to make sure that uh, of course like the chickens get taken out but we're looking pretty good like uh, we have poison harpies on the boss distraction on the back and then uh, just some well pegs on top of them because he was so low very easy to die at the same time so when it works it works really well when it doesn't work it doesn't work so like you're gonna you just are gonna have to keep playing it's not hard but you're probably gonna have to play it three or four times per class before you get the timings exactly right and that changes on every every uh year or two so this deck works really good when you get those fast units to get right up in there and then some unbound uh dps and tanks too i think this is a uh, probably one of the best decks to use but um you know there's definitely some things depending on what you you're dealing with that uh what cards you have that will be better for you so all right that's it good luck